Welcome back, YouTube, to another video. Today we are going to talk about what something frequency updates. Something happened last night. Okay, I was trying to fall asleep and this energy hit me. This deepest sadness I have ever felt. It was throughout my body. There was no pain in the heart chakra. There was only this deep sadness. I have never experienced this type of sadness in my life. To me, I honestly have no idea why I was feeling this. Then I saw a YouTube video title about um, like these false negatives waking up or something. Uh, let me go see if I can find that. And my mouse is just does not like me right now. Let me go find the video title. That's an ad. I don't want you. Go away, ad. Okay, we are going to this YouTube channel. Well, are you... No, really, well, is it? Okay, found it. Okay, the... This is what I saw this morning. Massive magnetic energy wave hits Earth, distorts positive negative ions. Then this was posted yesterday no, actually, since, well, the video was posted yesterday, but I also see the date July 8th, which is actually two days ago. Um... And basically all the, what I, okay, this is what I feel. The planet is not extending into 5D. Certain people are. The masses will continue to be on 3D. So there was a lot of misinformation there's a lot of false positives, if you will. I did not watch the video of the energy positive ion uh, video title. I just read it and it clicked. Is this why I felt the deepest sadness I have ever felt in my existence? Is that why? And then it kind of clicked. But to me, I honestly don't know why I felt that. However, in my previous video, I said, um, I said that, you know, I'm like, I, no. I didn't make the video. 
or if I did, I don't remember. Let me try to find it. Okay, I said this was two days ago. That I basically titled it A Forgotten Question Now Known to Me, The Answer. And around that time, I noticed something. I did not say this on video. I don't think I wrote a post about it. Actually, I forgot I did say about something. My brain is very distracted right now. I do apologize. Uh, let me try to get my thoughts together. Okay, so we have deepest sadness when trying to go to bed. It kind of, it did keep me awake. I tossed and turned for like over an hour because I could not get this sadness out of my system. It lingered and lingered. At first, Okay, basically it's like in level 1 and then it went to level 5. Like, slowly progressed. At first it wasn't that bad and then it just, bam, hit me. Nothing but this deep sadness. And I'm like, dude, I'm trying to fall asleep. Why is this hitting me right now? At this time. And then I see that video title that I said and then I'm like okay is that why but there was also false knowledge going on and false positives making you think some it will trick you into believing this when it's not even true but I as I said I did not watch the video and then it hit me is it because I noticed something inside me has changed? My energy? Something inside. I, I don't know how else to say that. Okay, let me start from the beginning. I met someone and... Something happened, he blocked me, I went into a downward spiral, the game of life knocked me down, it threw me off, I questioned my reality, I, like I said, I, my world crashed and burned. I was at rock bottom once again. I worked through it, the trauma, I worked through it, I questioned whether or not do I continue as a light worker, and then as I talked through that process, lo and behold, I continued my great work, I continued the mission, even when I was literally in confusion and dispel I don't I no, don't know if I want to use that word basically I was literally crying okay I, I was crying on the inside but you could tell by my energy something something's happened and she broke down but I bounced back and then I said well I wrote that since I answered that forgotten question my energy came back 100% however 
something else I noticed. So you have the guy blocked me. I went into a downward spiral and ever since that moment, that trauma, something inside me has never been the same. Like something is missing or something has not healed properly or is still healing or there was still a struggle shadow self going on. Something happened and you're not quite the same ever since that moment. That is what I am trying to say. Something happened and ever since then I have not been exactly the same. This moment that I just said hit me when I was feeling the deep sadness when I was trying to fall asleep. The deep sadness could be a brain, you're not working. Uh, is this, I literally hit a brick wall. That's what I felt like. Okay. Is the deep sadness a effect from that trauma that I had gone through and overcame? It could be. Is that the reason of the deep sadness? Perhaps. Or is it my empathic abilities feeling this person trying to reach out because before he blocked me, he said he was looking for someone. Okay, everyone, let me, rest, let me start from the beginning. Okay, you have multiple past lives or, well, some do, some don't. Uh, so if you're a person who believes in reincarnation and you feel you have had other lives, then this is what I'm trying to say. You met someone years, lifetimes ago. You bonded with this person and when you reincarnate again, you are going to look for the same person throughout all your lives. Could it be this? Maybe. I honestly don't know. But he said he was looking for someone because he met someone in his other lives and he was looking for this person in this lifetime once again, looking for this person. We thought, to, uh, we came to know each other and said, well, what if we did know each other before? Could it be that the deep sadness was not mine, but his, saying to himself, I am missing this long lost person. Did I just meet her only to let her out of my life? 
And then before that, I said I thought I was feeling energy that said he, that someone is missing me or made a mistake. Then this feeling of this deep sadness that I don't know how to explain it. It's just this deep sadness and it's like missing missing home like okay say for instance you are on vacation okay you're you're like you went overseas for a vacation and you're starting to miss your home you're starting to miss everything about it you're starting to miss friends and family, your pets. That's kind of what this deep sadness could be. That, okay, you know you're a star seed. you know where you came from. I came from the ninth dimension. That planet that I showed yesterday with from the Sumerian tablet, uh, tablet, uh, whatever you want to call it, I don't, I just said tablet for whatever reason, the star system is not of Earth, everyone thinks it is, but it's not, am I being, feeling, homesick because my soul knows Earth is not my home, I met someone who is of the kindred spirit, the same soul family, soul tribe and am I starting to feel that I am missing this person or missing my real home my home is in the stars I always felt that like earth is not my home well well is it to be honest is this deep sadness from all of that or is it because I am feeling this other person? The answers are up for grabs because I do not know how to answer this. All I know is ever since that moment in my life from that trauma I have not been exactly the same. Mo key moments wake us up, key moments shape us. To me, it is a key moment in this lifetime. We have multiple key moments. Um, I don't know how else to say that, uh, to be honest, um, but that is what is going through my mind right now, and nothing much else to say except thank you for your time, and until we meet again.